So I first have to ask you, because you've traveled so many places, Dude. what is your favorite place to visit? Uh, favorite place to visit would just have to be Amsterdam. It's where, uh, in the Netherlands, where I just got done living for the last seven months. And uh, I've been dubbing it as my soul city, per se. And uh, just everything about it, the culture, the people, the language, the architecture, it's all great. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. And what do you think people have to learn from your photos and from your travels? Um, basically, what I want people to take away is uh, just inspiration. The fact that, I mean, I picked up a camera for the very first time a year and a half ago. And th these are all images from the last year and a half. <laughs> There's, that's just, that's all there is. It's, uh, I mean, people have been telling me that I have an eye for it, but I just like to tell everybody that everyone is much more of a photographer than they think they are, and the biggest part about it is just go out and shoot, and uh, yeah, practice makes perfect. Right. How did you get started in photography? Um, I uh, received a, my first DSLR, like I said, a year and a half ago from my godmother as a late uh, high school graduation present, and from there, uh, I was lucky enough to be able to go on a two-week trip to Peru a month after receiving that camera, and then a week after I got back from that uh, Peru trip, I went on a month-long road trip across the Western United States. So it just, it was the perfect opportunity to just start and just go out and explore immediately right. after getting it. And of course, I have to ask, um, when, when you take photos, do you ever go to extreme measures to get these photos? Yeah, I, I like to tell people that uh, if you're not crouching down in really weird positions or you're not, you know, climbing up things or, you know, breaking the rules, then, I mean, what are you doing? You know, right. you, you're, you're, then you're doing it right. Um, but uh, specifically in this set of photos, there's one picture of the uh, parliament building in Budapest. And uh, I was running a little late to catch the sunset. <laughs> and uh, I was sitting in my hostel and I had lost track of time and I had to run a mile and a half from the pest side of Budapest across this bridge to the Buddha side. And I had this tie-dye shirt on, my glasses, and my backpack on with all my stuff. And I was just sprinting. And all of these people were just giving me the weirdest looks. Of, of, because of course, there's just like this hippie running through the city. And <laughs> what it, why is he doing that? You know? But as you'll see in the uh, slideshow, the shot I got of the parliament building was just absolutely worth it. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for being yes, here with us. I'm so excited to see what you have for us. Yes, thank you very much.
Ladies and gentlemen, the world through eyes like mine.